Hey guys, I'm African Creature and I'm back with another tutorial with Nana B. I I am so excited. It's about to be a tutorial on Passion Twist. Let's get started. First, we're going to start with Lulu Tress Bulk Hair Water Weave. You can use any type of water weave hair for this install. Now you're going to start and section your hair, getting one strand or two strands of your choice. For the beginning part, I started braiding it and then twisting it because I want it to hold a certain way, so I braid it and then I twist it. I'm going to show you a really thorough part of the video so you can see how I do it. So you're first going to take one strand and twist all the way to the right. And then you're going to take the other strand and twist all the way to the right. It's the same as you're doing Marley twists, but this time we're gonna overlap to the left, wrapping your hair into the extensions so that way it doesn't stick out. And then instead of rolling, you're going to now just fold it to the left, keep overlapping into the left. And to attach the ends, you're going to add the extensions again, doing the same concept as the roots and overlapping it to the left. And you continue to do this until you get to the ends of the hair. I want to give a shout out to Ike Slimster for this amazing beat. Thank you so much for supporting me and everyone else who's watching this video. Thank you, thank you, thank you. For each twist, she used four to five strands to get this length and to get this width. And we used about 10 packs in total. Now you're going to add some baby hairs to give a little action to your hairstyle. And then you're going to start by twisting it the same way as we did in the beginning and continue until you're done twisting the whole head. The secret to doing knotless passion twists is at the roots you must twist both strands to the right and overlap to the left. As you get maybe about midsection into the braid you shouldn't roll the hair to the left you should just throw it to the left so if that makes sense it's kind of like you're not going to be twisting it you're going to actually just put the strand on top of each strand instead of rolling it and that's the secret to getting it to get that crinkly kind of look and which each twist you must pull the hair strands up to give that desired look this is the Slimster. And this hairstyle can be done under four to five hours. And if anybody is interested in booking an appointment, definitely visit our website, hairbysuzy.com, to book this appointment. They also have this same hairstyle in crochet version, which is less time, it's about two to three hours.
after you're done with all the twists, you can just cut off all the flyaways. Thank you guys so much for watching our tutorial on how to do knotless passion twists featuring Nena B. I can't wait to see you guys. Hairstyles, definitely book our appointment at hairbysuzy.com. And shout out to Ike Slimster for the dope, dope beat. Ew, don't forget to subscribe. Ew.